A test was given to a group of students. The grades and gender are summarized below. If one student was chosen at random, determine the following probabilities. Give the answers as simplified fractions. Looking at the table, notice how we have the gender in rows and the grades in columns. It's also important to recognize in the bottom right-hand corner, we have a total of 72 students. Because one student is chosen at random, 72 is going to be the total number of outcomes for each probability. The first probability is the student was male. So looking at the table, notice how there are a total of 22 males. 22 is the number of favorable outcomes. Out of a total of 72 outcomes, the probability the student was male is 22 divided by 72, or 22 70 seconds. But this does simplify because 22 and 72 share a common factor of two. To simplify, we divide both by two, which gives us 11 36 Next, we're asked to find the probability the student was female. And we can find the females in this row here. There are a total of 50 females. Out of the total of 72 students, the probability the student was female would be 50 divided by 72, or 50 70 seconds, which again simplifies because both 50 and 72 share a common factor of two. The probability simplifies to 25 36. The next probability is the student was male and got an A. So looking at the row of males, the number of males that received an A is 11. 11 is the favorable number of outcomes out of a total of 72 outcomes. And therefore the probability is 11 divided by 72, or 11 70 seconds, which doesn't simplify. The next probability is that the student was female and got a B. Females are in this row, and Bs are in this column. The number of females that got a B was 13. 13 is the favorable number of outcomes out of a total of 72 outcomes. And therefore, the probability the student was female and got a B would be 13 divided by 72, or 13 70 seconds, which again does not simplify. And for the last probability, we have the probability the student got a C. So notice here, the student can be male or female. So going back to the table one last time, we have the C's in this column. The total number of C's is 27. And therefore, if one student is chosen at random, the probability the student got a C would be 27 divided by 72, or 27 70 seconds. But this does simplify. The greatest common factor between 27 and 72 is nine. To simplify, we divide both 27 and 72 by nine. 27 divided by nine is three. 72 divided by nine is eight. The simplified probability is three-eighths. Before we go though, let's review how to simplify a fraction on the T84. We enter the original fraction as 27 divided by 72. We press enter, which gives us the decimal. To convert to a simplified fraction, we press math, enter, enter, which does give us 3 eighths. I hope you found this helpful.